Well, summer is here, almost, not technically though. We're going to be spending more time outside, but we have to be careful in the sun. We know that too much can give your skin cancer, but there is a sunny side to catching some rays because they make vitamin D, something that our bodies need. Now, Dr. Will Clower joins us this morning to shine, I love that, shine some light <laughs> on the topic. How are you? I'm really good. Very good to see you. It's very good Great. to see you too. Okay. Good way and a bad way to get some sun, huh? Yeah, well, we all know that that uh, too much sun exposure can lead to skin cancer. As a matter of fact, I was talking to my friend uh, Dana Fox over at the American Cancer mm -hmm. Society, and she said that 40% of all cancers, all of them, are skin related. So there's a very, very sun. high incidence, mm -hmm. but uh, conversely, there's a very, very low mortality, which means that the, uh, the cancers tend to be slow growing and identifiable. And something that, that uh, we've done is we've put together, we've, we've gotten a graphic that we're going to put on the website for, uh, that looks at how you can tell if those little moles that pop up right. are, are cancerous, what to look for, the asymmetry, if and then, there it is right there, yeah, the, right, with, okay. if they're asymmetry, if the borders are irregular, if the colors are, are off where one side is darker than the other, and if, uh, if the diameter is large, then for those things you really need to get them checked out. Okay. And it doesn't matter how much pigment you have in your skin, everyone could be a danger of getting skin cancer. Um, everyone is a danger, but you know what? The, the pigment, the amount of melanin in your skin is a, uh, is a big factor. So if you have, uh, if you're, you have this Nordic white skin, you know, mm -hmm. very light, yes. pale, then you're at, much, at a much risk. greater right. risk mm -hmm. than if you're Afro-American, if you're Latin, if you're Asian. And it is that tendency to burn that is the risk factor. So if you have a higher tendency to burn, mm -hmm. then you need to be more aggressive about applying sunscreen to uh, prevent that from happening. Now, tell me, is there a good way to get some rays, a good way to get a tan? Do you give yourself so many minutes to be outside? We all know that you should put sunscreen on. When, when is it time to go inside? Uh, when you feel the burning. And so, uh, again, or whatever, yes, right? exactly, uh -huh. exactly. And so it's good to have some sunscreen on when you're outside, but, but you don't want to block it all together because if you do, you'll lose all that vitamin D that your skin makes, your body makes when you're outside in the sun. As a matter of fact, what I read was that, that we spend less time in the sun and we also have more vitamin D deficiency in this country than ever, ever, ever before. Really? Yes. And so something to, to notice that the, uh, the guidelines for vitamin D is that we get 400 units. They're called IUs. Um, and, and to get 400 units, you can have milk, you can have salmon, you can have uh, uh, mackerel, you can have deep water fish. Mm -hmm. But if you get outside for 10 to 15 minutes, you'll get between, get this, between 3,000 and 20,000 of those units just for 15 minutes in really? the sun. And so, gosh, get outside go for a walk and you get all of that that vitamin D which is so important for your bones so important for your health and okay. helps to prevent heart disease which which you don't get okay. if you if you stay inside all right and the vitamin the um, supplements yes supplements you can get too much of and your body will overprocess calcium which is a bad thing but you don't get that when you're out in the sun your body takes what it needs and demetabolizes the rest Smart body. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay. Thank you so what much for pleasure. joining us this Thank morning. Thank you so All much. All right. Now, if you would like to uh, contact uh, Dr. Clower or learn more about the dangers of the sun, you can check out his website. He's been talking about that. You can find that link at kdk.com slash PTL. Thank you.